What's up? I'm Kale. This is, this is Anthony. I'm working with Yeah, we stand for Notorious Cosmic Breakers. My name is Chaos from that crew. And this is our interview. And I'm Kevin Tate from the uh, Seattle VI Block 206. So, you told me your names already. What? So, what's your role in a group called NKB? Uh, me and some friends, I wouldn't personally say I'm a leader, because me and my friends, we thought it up from t table scratch, just thinking of names and everything. Uh, yeah, it's loud out there. Yeah. Doing a live show. Well, I'm more of like the person that holds it all together. I find shows, just like my manager here. And we just, I just hold everything together. So that's my role. We pretty much like, we don't have a leader. We pretty much like, shit like, if each member of the group, we treat them real equal. Because we believe in, there's like no leader and no followers. We all believe in people at other risk. Everyone is at the same rate, same level, and we treat each other with respect. That's why AKB is formed. Yeah. And also is that we form our skills and show people that we may be small. We may be middle schoolers and high schoolers, but we got a lot of things to express from our body to like show people that we're not scared to back down on anything. Yeah. Most mostly our crew is formed up of like this and that, like small stuff, but since there's no leader, we, we focus everybody as a leader. We don't think of anybody under ourselves. If somebody like, you know, they got an idea, we listen to that idea. Unlike some crews that like I'm not down on anybody, no disrespect, I'm just saying cause some people just want to listen to their ideas and sometimes it doesn't come out all right. But my crew, we put every idea into one single routine until it becomes perfect. It might not win some, but it's still like, yeah. We it's lose, but we still win. It's still something new that you got to learn and got to try. Yeah. Is, there, um, is it difficult to try these kind of things with your group and, you know, try new ideas? No, it's, it's very, because everybody in my crew, we know each other so well. Even the new cats that join us. Everybody is like so t tight together that we listen to each other. We know what moves are which moves. We focus on this and that, and we're so close that we can tell what moves we want to put in without even talking to each other. Cool. So, how many of you are there in the NKB group? NKB, there's about there's about twelve of us. Twelve. Nice. Yeah. Especially cool. some from Renton. Some from Renton, Seattle, Kent, all over. Whoa. So, for people at home or anywhere that doesn't know, what does NKB stand for? Yet again, it stands for the Notorious Cosmic Breakers. Awesome. So, how long did it take you to um, create, like, from the ground up, how long did it take you to create NKB and think of the name, etc.? Well, it kind of, it came, the Notorious came up from me because when I was a kid, it's like, it's like what people say, hip hop saved your life. It's like when I was growing up, you know, looking at hip hop, it was like, you know, all girls and stuff like that. These guys just like pimping hoes and stuff like that. I looked at it like, I hated hip hop. I like really neglected it. I was a smart little Asian kid, didn't really like, you know, pay attention to all this and that. But growing up, I learned that without like hip hop there in your life, then like, you know, it's, it just doesn't flow right with anything. So that's where we got Notorious from. We got Notorious from all the gang bangs, all the bad and stuff like that that happened. Cosmic is because, you know, we're out of the world. We flow with everything. We got different styles, everything. Stuff you've never seen before, stuff you have, but in a different variety. And breakers. Last word of breakdancing crew is the breakers, you know? That's cool. You have a breaker in one form, the notorious. It's kind of stuttering right now. It's all good. Notorious cosmic breakers. Yeah. It took us about, what, six to five months. Just trying to figure out the name. Wow. So, so how long? How many places have you been performing? We have performed live. So, like the Sonics games, we perform for a lot of shows. Sometimes backups, like shows, stuff like that. We're doing ciphers. And sometimes we do like shows out of like Seattle. We do in Oregon, some New York. We flew to Tokyo and we flew to Tokyo. All that. You flew to Tokyo? Yeah. We flew to Tokyo. Whoa. Like sponsorship. Like the Mortal Kombat. We battled Mortal Kombat crew. We battled a lot of different crews. We might, we've flown there for other breakers, not just ourselves. We're not that good yet, but we're still going up. We may battle from here to here, but then it's not like full on battles. Oh. These are um, members growing strong. Are you trying to recruit new people? What no, kind of, right, right now, we can recruit. We can recruit, but the thing is, right now, throughout oh, summer's happening, a lot of live shows, stuff that people are really gonna want. Yeah, it's like it's like that. It's like we we have 
people that we need, but we still don't need people. So it's like all in that type of order where we want some, but we still have to keep some. Right. Um, got a couple of questions. Like, what if someone wants to join your group? What what would happen? Pretty much show your skills, what you've got, and you show respect to us. We show respect back. Like mostly your skills and your respect matters to us the most. It we, don't, we don't count on race. We don't count. On, we don't count on race. That's it. There's there's no discrimination in our group. Nothing. If somebody wants to join, they can join. The thing is, they just have to prove themselves to me, to the crew. You know, show no disrespecting. They at least at least have to be like you know there for everybody else and say when they gotta make it there, they're gonna make it there. Discrimination, you get relate. You get hell in discipline. You get a lot of discipline. No, I'm just kidding, just kidding. Right. So, anyways, let's see. Anyways. So, where do you train a lot your skills? Like, you know, uh, Jefferson Community Center, Franklin High School, um, a lot of places, really a lot of places. So, so any closing comments you would like to make? Um, for the people at home, if you want to become a break dancer, just. <laughs> we got a lot of doors. Yeah, open. that's Gabriel Teodros. Yeah. <laughs> the man with the beard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. For everybody at home that wants to become a break dancer, my word is. Express yourself. Basically, express yourself. Dance isn't everybody. Don't think of it as one type of thing. It's like, it's like rap. You just let it flow. Follow the beat, and you get there. Yeah. All right. Well. Thanks for your time. Yep. I'm Kevin Tain with the PI Blog 206 and I'm signing out.